Today we're talking quiet luxury without that loud price tag that it normally comes with. This video is sponsored by Quince. I'm gonna show you guys some new things that I picked up from Quince and of course I will have links to everything for you right down below in the description box and also in the comments. Last year I was just flipping through Instagram, <laughs> as one does, and I came across this really beautiful bedding set and I, you know, comment bed for links, and I did, and I got the links, and I went ahead and I ended up purchasing um, a, just a bunch of like bed stuff for my guest room, and I put it up, I think I set it up on camera with you guys, and I set it all up, and I was like, oh wow, this actually is very nice, I love me and Lewis together, we'll like leave this bed, and we'll just go sleep in the guest room bed together, like, you know, if, if you have the option, right, but I love, love, love that bedding, and at some point I'm gonna upgrade this bedding, only because the cats are in here a lot, and like, They've done some things to this bedding. <laughs> it needs to go. Anyway, that's how I was first introduced to Quince. And it was actually, uh, yeah, I think earlier this month, I asked you guys, because I'm planning all these fashion videos, da da da, I asked you guys, hey, where are you shopping? What's getting you excited? Where are you guys actually buying clothes for the fall, for the winter, etc. And I compiled this huge list of everything that you guys said and Quince was on the list so they reached out to sponsor and I was like, it's giving divine intervention because you're literally on my list. So I picked up a bunch of different items. So Quince very much does give that quiet luxury feel. They managed to somehow have like sustainably made items that are also affordably priced. It's not a combo that you often see. So you're gonna get that luxury feel without actually having to shell out hundreds and hundreds or thousands of dollars for it, which is a beautiful thing. Let me preface by saying your girl's wearing a bodysuit underneath here, okay? So I do have a little bodysuit on that goes down to my knees, and I just wanna show you the base of my outfit before we get into the real star of the show. Although the dress is feeling like a star as well, so this is a slip dress, it's a rib knit slip dress. The length for me is absolutely perfect on this thing. Let me spin as I walk back to you. That was actually too many spin. Oh, I am getting old. Obsessed. Love the dress. Absolutely beautiful. What's funny about this one is when it's not like on your body and it's just on a hanger, it actually has this exact same shape. Like it goes in and then the hips come out and then it goes in at the knee and then it kind of bells out at the bottom. And I don't know if that's what makes it just especially... You know what I'm saying? But it's, it's definitely not hurting it. And this one is definitely more affordable than the uh, other guys, let's call them. And if at any point I forget to mention sizes and stuff that I'm wearing, I'll just pop it up on screen. Did I tell you the size I'm wearing in this? I don't think I did. Uh, I think it's an XL. They do have extended sizes, so they carry um, stuff in plus. Now introducing the star of today's show, Cashmere. So they recently revamped their cashmere line and I picked up a few items that I thought would really be able to kind of stand the test of time in my closet. I, I recently got rid of a ton of cardigans and stuff because they were so like 2018. Do you know what I mean? Like the cardigans were so specific to the era in which I purchased them that I just couldn't see myself wearing them anymore. And it kind of pained me to get rid of them because I'm like, there's nothing wrong with them. I just know that I'm never gonna wear them. But these are a lot better. They're a lot more timeless and definitely better for someone who, like if you're looking into making like a capsule wardrobe, for instance, these items are definitely a lot more timeless. So this is a Mongolian cashmere cardigan. And I got it in an XL because I figured that's was gonna fit me, you know what I mean, like just fine. I do like the versatility of it. Obviously you could wear it with a little dress like this and I love all the little hacks and everything that people have online you know okay they put the buttonhole over here they do it over here they flip it over here like what a fun time to be on the internet you guys have a hack for everything I swear it is actually a pretty decent length it's not like cropped up under your boobs however how would we feel if it was do you know what I mean I'm thinking of putting a belt on my waist and cropping it up because while I absolutely love wearing like bodycon type stuff in theory and online because you guys love to hype me up and I'm here for it thank you for the thank you for the boost we appreciate it in reality I don't leave the house a lot of times dressed like this because it just feels very like revealing you know what I mean but like when I have a chunky little knit cardigan to put over it well then it doesn't feel so revealing anymore now I just feel kind of cute I feel like I could wear this to church like I could wear it to the mall I could wear it to church I could wear it to a coffee date which is 90% of the time you know, if I'm not going for coffee, 
I'm going for groceries. There's very little in between in my life. Now, if you are someone who happens to know anything about cashmere, I recently learned how it was made and it was very, very, very interesting. The video just popped up on my feet at all. It felt very kismet. If you already have a little bit of knowledge about it, then you might be interested to know <laughs> that this is made from a grade A Mongolian cashmere. It's extremely soft. You should look up how cashmere is made. You should also look up how silk is made. They're both fascinating. One of them was very eye-opening. <laughs> I w I'm not gonna tell you which one. And here she is with, you know what, the bodysuit kind of goes. I was just gonna say I need to like button it up, but the bodysuit kind of goes. Just, you know, with a little little pair of jeans, a little elevated, simple everyday look. Something about a cardigan that makes me want to go like this and contemplate my life and look at my kids and how big they've grown. Where's my coffee? Now they have a lot of different colors, but now that I'm looking at my bed, which is where I have everything, I'm realizing I ordered a lot of the same color because I like this color. I think it brings out my eyes and my hair. Like, I just think all together it looks really good on me. So there's no reason for me to branch out into other colors just because. Keep that in mind. They do have a slew of colors. Now this is another Mongolian cashmere crew neck sweater. So it's a little bit different. We have a little bit, I was gonna show it to you with the dress on and I am, but I just thought I would show you that it looks cute with a pair of jeans. And like I said, I did a lighter color because this is what I like to wear. I would just do a nude bra obviously underneath this. It feels lovely. It has a little stretch to it. For me when I think cashmere I think luxury and it probably goes back to that Seinfeld episode from like a million years ago. Like I was like oh cashmere. Like I, I just to me it just means luxury 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 but the beauty of Quince is that they have like a factory direct model which just means that they can cut out the middleman and that means you don't have to pay that extra money in order to get quality, long-lasting items, which is a beautiful thing. I mean, anytime a, a company wants to go the extra mile to make their items more affordable and more accessible for the consumer, I'm all for it because not everybody does that. Oh, okay. This is actually my first time putting it on. I was just like hoping it was gonna fit me and you guys, it's like literally a perfect fit. I got this in a 1X. I also have the sweater in a 1X. But this is a 100% washable silk slip dress. That's nice, girl, because one thing about me, I don't iron and I don't go to the dry cleaner. I just don't. I mean, I should and maybe I will. My boyfriend goes and I feel like you're so sophisticated. It's so nice. This one is from their like extended sizes. Like I said, I got it in a 1X. So they do have two other colors available as well. And they have different lengths as well. So if you're not into this particular length, I have just been seeing a lot of like midi length stuff. And I thought it's a cute look. I just need to figure out the right shoe to pair with a midi situation because I have thicker calves and for me I go for a very specific look on my bottom half when I am like trying to style an outfit. I thought that this little sweater would go perfectly with this little dress. Okay so just straight on this is where it lands on me and this is not necessarily how I would style it right. All we need is a little skinny belt and I'm gonna go ahead and belt it right around my like right under my bra. I do have a double padded push-up bra on and I feel like that's not necessary <laughs> for this particular look. It's necessary for a lot of looks as far as I'm concerned, but not this one. Now this does take a second of patience to make sure you get it all flat. Now this is how I would like actually wear it. I just had to, you know, tuck a little bit. Obviously you could just wear a bigger belt over top of it and pull it up a little bit if you wanted that look, but I like the silk to the cashmere with no break in between it. It feels luxurious. And don't we deserve that sometimes? Why don't I always dress like this? Wait, okay, so the length of this one is actually perfect. Thank God I ordered something in a different color so I could show you they do have lots of color options. This is nice, it's actually a skirt so it doesn't go all the way up. It is again that 100% machine washable silk slip style, but the fit of it is absolutely lovely. I have it in a 1X again. I do still have plenty of space around my butt and my hips, and it does have a little bit of give, and then the waistband itself is also nice and stretchy, so it's gonna accommodate, you know, different uh, belly and torso sizes. But then on top, I have, again, the Mongolian cashmere, but this is a polo sweater, so it does open up, and I, I like it. I like that there's no buttons here, too, actually. That's, I'm... <laughs> Sometimes the buttons irritate me around this area like because then you have to kind of like bring in the color of the button. 
I like that there's nothing there. <laughs> you could just do whatever you want. It wouldn't be me if I didn't end it with a little matching sweatsuit situation, except she's wearing cashmere from head to freaking toe. I got this whole set in an XL because it's stretchy. So, I mean, I pretty much figured that was gonna work. Cashmere is very forgiving. It has a beautiful little drape to it. You can get a lot of different types of cashmere. Everything that I'm showing you guys, it's very soft, it's very warm. It has a nice little bit of give to it, but obviously with a little kick, you know, a little kick back, it's gonna come back to where it needs to be. These pants that I'm wearing do have functional pockets in the front and as an added bonus, Functional pockets in the back. I wore I wore a pair of pants the other day with a back pocket. It was a pair of sweats. Very handy. Very handy dandy tool to have, let me tell you. Pants are really good length. And then on top, I have our little zippy jacket situation. Obviously, I picked this up in a gray. A lot of my sweatsuits tend to be in gray. I don't know. If I'm relaxing, I'm in gray. To me, they go hand in hand. But underneath this little cutie pie honey bunch, which does have a hood. Underneath we have the cute little cropped tank that matches. I decided to be very matchy matchy with it. They do have quite a few different colors for the zip hoodie, for the pants. You mix and match however you would actually wear it. But me personally, I do like a coordinating situation. These are all super warm, they're super soft. That's kind of the whole idea. That's why it's so luxurious. It's such a beautiful fabric to have. And as far as the sizing goes, if you're not quite sure where you would land, they do have free shipping on all orders and they have 365 day returns, which is like literally unheard of. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this little haul. I really wanna to bring to you different brands and different styles of clothing. I mean, I'm not gonna go way crazy and go totally out of my realm into things that I would personally absolutely never wear, but I do like to show you guys a variety of different things. We can go high, we can go low, we can go mid. The name of the game today was clearly affordable luxury, like very much giving high-end feels without super high-end prices. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I will, of course, have links to everything down below in the description box, and I will reiterate uh, what sizes I'm wearing and everything down there in case I missed it. But I hope that you guys are gonna have just the most amazing day, weekend, week. I don't know what day of the week it is. I hope you're just gonna have an amazing day. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, and I will see you guys in my next one.